I'm going to share with you one of my favorite quick and easy meals to make and that's saltfish curry coconut. And I just love this meal because it's easy to prepare. It's a great dish to prepare for breakfast and I usually have it with fried breadfruit or what Jamaicans call ground provision. That is your boiled green bananas, yams or dumplings. So let's get into the ingredients. Here's what you're going to need. First, you're going to need curry powder. If you can get the real Indian curry, it will make a huge difference in the taste of this dish. Then we'll be using the Maggi coconut powder. But you can use coconut, which will make the taste better. But again, this is just a quick meal for me. And we have our seasoning, which is onions, garlic, tomato, bell peppers, scallion, and of course, scotch bonnet pepper. I will be preparing this dish with some green bananas, pumpkin, and Irish potato, our ground provisions. Now, the first thing you're going to do is soak the saltfish. I normally pick the saltfish up in chunks and soak it. So it's just a quick way to get rid of the excessive salt. Then while the saltfish is soaking, I'm going to prepare the ground provisions. I usually oil my hands to prevent the banana stains from staining my hands and I peel away. And I actually hate peeling bananas. I hear you can boil the bananas in the skin. I never tried it before. Then we peel the potatoes and cut up the pumpkin. Now I have a compost bin and I throw the peels away because I don't want to waste anything. I'm going to put some water to boil with a tablespoon of coconut oil for the ground provisions. While I'm waiting on the water to boil, I'm going to cut up the seasoning. Now, I love it when my saltfish has in a lot of seasoning, whether it's being prepared like this or if I'm doing cook up saltfish, it has to have a lot of seasoning. And being Jamaican, I love to use scotch bonnet pepper. It's a must for most of my dishes as it brings up the flavor in the food. So the excessive salt is soaked off to my satisfaction and it's ready to be prepared. I add coconut oil to the pot on a medium fire. Then I add three cloves of garlic and half a scotch bonnet pepper with the seeds of course, along with the curry powder. going to stir that up a bit then I'm going to add the seasoning and saute it in just for a little bit I mix up the coconut milk and put it in the pot and stir it up and just wait till it kind of boils up and has that thick rich look we're going to add some black pepper, pimento and thyme, what we call seasoning of the pot. That's what we Jamaicans love to do to bring up the flavor. Then we're going to add the saltfish to the mix. Mix it up a bit and let it simmer down on low heat. And that's it. Simple, easy to make. One of my go to quick breakfast recipe. So save this post, try this recipe and thank me later. Let me know what you think in the comments about this dish. Thank you for watching and until next time.